Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Coffee lovers, welcome. Um, I'm Christian, documentally from Our Man Inside, and I'm here for Express Coffee UK, .co.uk, who very kindly uh, lent me this Jura Ena 5. Um, I've had it for over a week now, and I'm loving the simplicity of it. I've had massive one-touch machines costing thousands of pounds. Um, but this is definitely more my kind of thing. Not only is it um, a great size to have in the kitchen, it still gives you that feeling that you're going from uh, bean to cup um, with total control, but in no time at all. The water goes in the back here, in a very nice little water container which has the filtration built in. The coffee beans go into the top. Just empty the bag in there. Mm, mm, mm. If you want to do a bit of powder, say you want to alternate, oh, tonight it's after six o'clock, I'm going to have myself a decaf. There's a little nozzle you slide to the side here, drop that funnel in, pour your re, you know, pre-ground coffee powder in there. Of any, you know, you might just fancy a different flavour and, and you're ready to go. Um, I kind of like that. The light system at the front here, it's just one knob and a little screen, you've got um, red, amber and green. Green, everything's hunky-dory like it is now. Amber, you may want to take a look at your coffee beans and your water. Red, change your water, or uh, sorry, fill your water or um, put some more beans in because it's needed. Um, pretty simple. I'm going to use a large cup, even though I'm, I'm more of an espresso drinker, if I'm totally honest. And um, I'm going to rotate this dial to say... Let's go for mild. You've got normal, mild and strong. But I've already had lots of coffee. Can you tell? Um, here we go. Beans grinding away. The heater will now be firing up. Um, one kind of um, heating unit in here. The more expensive the coffee machine, the more heating units you're going to have. So that's shared between the milk and the coffee the delicious coffee which we can see coming out now. Now I'm going to do a bit of a latte just because I want to show you how easy it is to add the milk to this now. Um, I say one knob, you've got the, um, the steaming switch just here. That's there and ready to go. So I'm going to rotate this now to, you can obviously have two cups or the rest of it, one espresso off each each of these novels, nozzles. And I'm going to rotate to Steam. I press that and it's going to say heating. So that's now heating over here. Right, let's drop this down. If I'm, if I'm having just a little cup, I can drop that straight under there. But very cleverly, I can do that. I love this little container here because it means that if I'm having a lot of coffee or a few people round or, you know, I'm a big coffee drinker or this is in your office, fill that with milk, put it to and from the fridge whenever you want, milky coffee. Me being me, I'm utilising the little hose that also comes with this and just dipping it straight into a milk bottle. Why not? Um, it's a good receptacle, uh, recyclable, etc, etc. Save me dishwashing that as well. So here we go. It says ready to go, so let's go. Literally, literally just turning that to the side and going... <laughs> Lovely bit of steam. And, um, and that will just... If you have them switch in the wrong position, um, fill away and create a delicious, nutritious a cup of coffee for me. Nice foamy latte. I've got my dose of coffee in the bottom, um, and I'm filling it with some lovely foamy milk. This is probably the third coffee I've had today, um, but all in the name of demonstrating properly. Some people put their um, milk in first and pour the coffee down through it. I alternate because that's the kind of guy I am. So there we go. That's pretty much done. Off. Bit of sugar in there. You're ready to go. Dead simple. The Ena 5. Um, if you want to empty the drip tray, that's so easy. There's the drip tray because it will rinse itself. And that is the little container for your coffee grounds. Just chuck it in the bin. Loving it. Check out Express Coffee, expresscoffeeuk.co.uk. Loads of information and obviously the latest prices. Quite affordable for what it does, I think. Cheers.